Hello everyone, Rich here. I had not intended on making this a retro video, but it turns out that it has to be. You'll see why in a moment. Now this video is for Yahoo Mail users. Now as you know, Yahoo Mail, or if you didn't know, now you do, Yahoo Mail has three versions of their mail. They have the original classic version, the 2007 version, which was around since obviously 2007, and the brand new one, which is out now. Now I'm going to log into a Yahoo Mail account using Firefox 5, which at the time of this recording is the latest version of Firefox. And I'll log in using an account I don't use. And here is the new Yahoo Mail interface, which collectively speaking, most people really, really hate. I don't know too many people that like this. If you like it, that's cool. No problem with that, but there's most people that say, Woof, this is Yahoo said it was faster, most people say it's not, and so on. Now, up until very recently, you could click options and switch back to the 2007 interface, but now, look at this, it's gone. Uh oh. Well, can you get it back? Believe it or not, you can. <laughs> But you have to use an old browser to do it, and that's the crazy part. So I'm going to sign out here. And this is where the retro part comes in, because I had to use Windows 2000 to do this. Um, so anyway, uh, you're going to use Internet Explorer 6, of all things. So we're rocking IE6 here, and I'm going to log into the Yahoo Mail account. Same one. And you'll get a bunch of nasty grams, but that's okay. So same Yahoo account. Now when I try to log in with IE6, it actually gives me a little nasty gram here that says, your browser doesn't support the newest version of Yahoo Mail, but I do get the option of returning to a previous version here. Aha. Click. Yay, classic Yahoo Mail. All right. Which to some uh, long-time users of Yahoo Mail, they'll say, yes, that's exactly what I want. Oh, God bless it. Yes, they do, would in fact, say that. And yeah, this is classic Yahoo Mail. And the great thing about it is that once I switch back, I'll sign out of it in IE6, go back to the modern browser, in this case Firefox. Even if I was using uh, Chrome or Opera, it would be the same thing at this point. So, And what I mean by that is that when I go back to the modern browser and log in, guess what I see? Classic interface! Yes! And I guarantee you, some people that are going to watch this video are going to say, Thank you! <laughs> yes, I wanted, I hate the new Yahoo Mail interface. I wanted the classic one. Well, I was able to do it by going into Windows 2000 in a virtual machine here, and then going into IE6, logging with the account, purposely telling it, No, I want the classic version. And then I get it, and it stays. As long as I don't go back to where, you know, don't click this link that <laughs> says newest version, because then you'll, you know, go back to the other one. Now it may be true that when you try this, uh, if, if you are a Yahoo Mail user and really like the classic interface and do this, uh, you may actually get bumped back to the 2007 version first. That's okay because you can go over to the right side here and uh, click options and you'll see switch to Yahoo Mail Classic uh, if you hit the 2007 version and then it will revert back to Yahoo Mail Classic. How long will this work? I don't know. It works right now, and you're able to do this with uh, any Yahoo account. I tested it with two or three Yahoo accounts I have, and it all everyone worked, and I was so happy about that. I said, "Ah, oh, cool! You know, I get the classic interface back when I want it. Sweet." Now, if you do not have access to a computer that has IE6 on it, there is another way to do it. You could, if you wanted to, use Firefox 2, which also is not supported by Yahoo Mail and it would give you the same nasty gram and you could revert using that. To get Firefox 2 the site is ftp colon slash slash ftp dot mozilla dot org and then pub for public and then Firefox and then uh, releases and then scroll all the way to the bottom and then there's uh, latest 2.0 and the uh, then you do you're most likely using the Windows platform, so it would be Win32. And then you pick your localization, which for me is en.us for United States, 
and there it is Firefox 20020 if you already have Firefox 5 uh, a newer version installed you can't do this unless you uninstall Firefox specifically un uh, install Firefox 2 and then do the Yahoo thing and then uninstall and then <laughs> it's a lot of work it's uh, if you have a virtual PC you can use or uh, another older computer like with Windows 98 or 2000 or a, a version of XP that was never upgraded from IE6 um, like something in the office or something like that where you work whatever then you can do it otherwise um, yeah it will uh, you, you gotta do it with IE6 or Firefox 2 otherwise it's not going to work and I know it's a lot of BS just to get this back but for some people <laughs> they will be willing to go through all that crapola just to get this back and again how long will this hold for before Yahoo Mail forces the new interface upgrade I don't know it's working for now so or else you have to go back to the newest version and then you'll have to deal with